bad day today for sure, but I think we got some grommage. That now that's not grommage. <laughs> nice one though. You know, I think that we got some grommage here today, and I thought, oh, I think I think that was a girl. You know, I hate to say that because sometimes I think it, but it's not. Okay, so this is the. <laughs> oh yeah, down she go. This is the last of three jumps in uh, Pacific City. <laughs> nice crab by the coach. JCT hand bringing it down with a nice super smooth one. So anyway, so the goal here actually is to go down to the uh, larger jump or the first large jump in Pacific. I mean, I'm sorry, not Pacific City. That's where we are now. But we're going to run it on down to... Uh, down to the big jump in the point. And maybe we'll stop at the three line in Cannon Beach and see what's going on there as we go down. But this is the uh, this is the NBSCF free ride program. And see, okay, he's just showing them the nose press, see? So he's showing them the nose press and they're gonna get it down. Because they got a program up here to teach the kids how to do the free ride. <laughs> you know? So go on, take a free ride. Go on, big by the side. Come on, take a free ride with MBSC. So okay, so we are gonna go to the third jump down here and we're gonna stand by and check some of these folks out. Stand by. Put my goggles on, okay. Okay, there, goggles on, okay. I'm good. Okay, this is the second one. Oh, hell, let's stop at the second one for a minute. Now, the thing is, this is the wide lens, so you know, the, the long shots are like really long. Oh, <laughs> yeah, nice, Grumster. Okay, going for the, the third one and sailing it a little knuckle, a little short. Oh, nice back flip right there. Okay. Yeah, on again. Okay, these guys, I'll tell you what, they never cease to amaze me, you know. And, you know, I don't care to you are a damn snowboarder, you're a skier. I'm a skier, I'm a snowboarder. Well, I haven't snowboarded in years, but, but I can snowboard. And I actually got a little song about that. It goes something like this. It goes, I can snowboard and I can ski, but you're never going to see me tell them I'll ski. I like coffee. I sell my drink tea. And you're never going to see me tell them I'll ski. Because, you know, hey, you got to draw the line. So, oh, yeah, you got to draw the line somewhere, you know. I'm not, you know, like I genuflected when I was a kid when I went to church. Yeah. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. I was I was brought up in an Episcopal church, and I was a, a, an acolyte. Uh, an acolyte is like that's the guy that you know carries in the candles and all that stuff. And uh, and we did genuflex, you know, like the Catholics did, I guess, before you know you went uh, into the pew, you know. And uh, the pew is like that's the row of seats, you know, and all that stuff. So anyway, so here we go. We're at. The, we're gonna see some of these guys again. First big jump on the point line. Oh yeah, nice style, nice style. Okay, flat line again today. So you know, one thing about Bachelor Parks too, you guys, is that makes it a little more difficult is on your exposures and whatnot. Is you got the white here, and then as soon as they go into the air and stuff. Uh, they got trees in the background so when they got trees and they're all wearing these earthy colors you know they do kind of disappear right there you know but uh, so sometimes you got to look a little bit harder <laughs> to, you know and th th this camera I just use the auto exposure so she adjusts pretty quickly but not quickly enough sometimes you know to get the good expo oh yeah nice to get the right exposure but you know there there is a joy to uh you know the automaticism 
of you know of a certain camera that you know that that does the automaticness you know at least to at least to a decent degree where you know hey you can get the shot you know oh yeah 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 the coach oh nice a little easy down and back up and just spinning that puppy all around okay so that's it they all went by so now we're gonna stand by so blah 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 Rom's coming in this way checking them out yeah 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 okay you know, and I heard the one up there, one guy was telling the other guy, he goes, do a hand plan. He goes, I can't do a hand plan. But you know what? He did do it. Yes. You know, and maybe not the biggest, most raddest, awesomeness. But you know what? Hey, y'all got to start somewhere. And these guys are just like eight years old or something. So give them cred. Cred what credit's due. Okay. Coming in, switch. Oh, oh, D, D Lone, be smooth. We've all seen him. If you've watched my vids. Oh! On the frickin' was it that was that was a frickin' ten. Was that a ten? That was a really long shot. Again with the wide, you know. And uh I could zoom a little bit, but I don't use a viewfinder or anything, so you know like and uh you start hitting that zoom and it messes up your your stabilization to a degree too so anyway I don't generally use the zoom uh, use the zoom uh, unless I take the wide off and then you know maybe I could do some zoomage videos or whatever but no biggie anyway so just you know you've heard me say before when I when I get down to that looking at the jump below you know yeah that's a long shot with the wide lens for sure but hopefully you could see that and maybe you could count how many ribs uh, Dylan made. If Well, okay, so it was at least, it was at least a seven for sure. And uh, if it wasn't a seven, it was a freaking 10. But you know, I don't know, because like I've said before, I cannot always count this stuff. They're working, they're waving. What up? Show us some tricks, man. Okay, we're standing by. There's the Groms. Hey, you know, I got, you know, a lot of these Groms, they are my fan club. Here's the two guys from Sweden. These guys from Sweden, bringing it, bringing it. And they got a, they got a channel and they got a video on New Schoolers. It's called uh, Tune In, Tune in. Turn On and Drop Out, man. And these guys, I might get, be able to get a real lap with them before this. Oh, this buddy. No, what's up? I got my buddies so, over he's, here. He's, They're he's, going about here. Yeah. This guy's coming in to get his shot, man. Oh yeah, and we, we got, got it. it. We got to respect that. Filming the guy, filming the guy, filming the guys, and filming the guys too. Throwing, throwing the yeah. boys a little bone here, you that's, know. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, this yeah. guy must have some race training because he got the pot gear on, you know. Oh yeah, yeah. And usually, oh, oh, this is, oh, this is my man Roy. Oh, okay. that's Roy. Yeah, and Roy I don't know who crossover. was that behind. Oh, that's Jack Bodie. Jack Bodie. Going oh! oh, that is a freaking long shot with this cam, but Jack Bodie with the back off the. That'll do a little race training. For I'm you. telling you what, you guys are awesome. Love you crossovers. Okay, so like you heard me talk about, that was uh, in a real lap that I did the other day. Was uh, Grant Hamlin, which actually his nickname is Roy. <laughs> oh yeah, the front. He prefers Roy. But you know, but it's given, you know, it, so we use Grant in the video because it is, it's, oh, Garrick, Garrick Petty John coming in there. Okay, we got some borders stacking up for this puppy right here. They're going to put it right in my, in my doggone face here for sure. Come on, Adler, hit that, hit that puppy. I was going to say B, but you know, we got to kind of keep it G here, you know. So, oh, yeah, we don't say B because we're going to keep it G. Coming on in. Frickin' is that Ted? That Ted? I ain't seen I ain't seen Ted in a while. Here comes Alex. Oh hell yeah. Okay. They're working it, you know. Are these guys giving us a show? And don't you know? <laughs> you, you just gotta like that, you know? Hey, let's have some fun, you know. It don't have to be the biggest, raddest stuff in the world, you know. Uh, I don't get paid for this stuff. Nobody getting paid. My channel is not monetized or anything else, you know, so why do I do this? Hey, I do this for the fun. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> a little short, but he hung on. 
And you know, so what? If you can't have some freaking fun, what the hell's up? <laughs> so standing by. Oh, no, wait, maybe not. No, he's coming this way. Yeah, yeah. He giving it what it's worth, and that was not bad. Okay, now, okay, not standing by. Coming down for the, it looks a little slow to me. I hope he got the pop. Oh, a little short, but he hung on. So, yeah, he knew, he landed right freaking there and uh, should have landed like, you know, down there somewhere. But you know what? I give I give cred, you know, because he saw me down there and he says, I'm going to freaking go for it, you know? And I'll tell you what, as easy as these kids make it look, I'll tell you what, when you're coming down the damn hill, and I have jumped before, believe me, I used to jump the big ones, but I haven't jumped the big ones in over 90 years. And I've got to tell you, man, when I come down the hill and I'm looking at that freaking ramp, it scares the crap out of you, man. And you got to get over that fear somehow, you know. And these kids, they got no fear because they hit that thing like nothing and they make it look easy. So, you know, and this is the first jump in the point line and the second two are only bigger. Like, and I mean not a little bigger, I mean like what way up? bigger. What up, you want to get a shot? What do you got, a death lens on that thing? Okay, wait a minute, coming over here. This guy got like a death lens on a freaking iPhone and he's working it. Who is this? This is David Ray. David Ray! <laughs> <laughs> Snowboard! <laughs> I was going, I was going, that looks like David, but that's a damn snowboard. So what's up with that? See, he, he can do them both, see? David can snowboard and David can ski, but I hope you never freaking tell him all keys. <laughs> you know, but hey, if David goes and tell him keys one day, you know, I will not put him down for that, not at all. Okay, we got one that took a fall, and but he's still standing by. Okay, so we got a whole group now standing by up here. You know what? I've been rolling this camera for a while. I have not had to make a cut. So let's see what's up. As long as I can stay excited. You coming in for a shot, bro? Yeah. You got your cam? Get out in front of me, man. I'm feeling... Oh, it's just on the iPhone. This guy's got the DPS skis, you know, and that... Oh, he got some rivets in the front. On the telly, I'm man. telling you what. That Okay, I got the song and you guys heard me sing it. But he got the DPS because those are super skis, super awesome. And best. I can snowboard and I can ski, but... You're never gonna see me tell them all key. But this guy can right here, and I bet she does it good. I have seen guys that can park on Telemark. I mean, like, you just can't even freaking believe. Checking this guy out. Oh! <laughs> style can points. Can I get a... Style points heavy on that stretch out. Did you see that guy? Oh my God, that was one of the best I've seen all season. I mean, he got that thing sideways in the air and and uh, he stretched his entire body out. <laughs> like, <laughs> that was awesome. Style points heavy, that was a skialicious move for sure. And that guy sailing it perfect into the sweep, into the deep. What's up? Oh, I'll tell you what, this is a freaking Wednesday. But we got action from the Groms here with MBSCF Ooh, crew. That's Dirk Kush. Uh, uh, Dirk, tell, tell hey. us what their names are if you know them. Kirby. I don't, uh, I don't know all their freaking names. We got a guest commentator here, and they're working it down. Oh, nice, nice. nice. I, that guy probably could have been more than about eight years, ten years old, though, anyway. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> oh, beautiful seven. These guys make it look Tyler. so easy, you know. Yeah. Oh, and again, oh, oh a little, a little bobble on the seven, but he's right All back right, up. See ya. Hey, you be good, brother. See Ciao. Ya. These guys are freaking awesome. That's all I can tell you guys. Okay. Flat light day here. But I don't know if you guys are having fun yet, but I'm having fun. And uh, stand by, it looks like we got some snowboarders and some skiers. And they're standing by, the one of them's looking like he's throwing them, he's showing them how to throw them. You know, he's going like, okay, you're gonna spin your arms like this when you hit it. Oh, seven on the board, seven on the board. Bringing it down. 
I have a hard time counting spins, but... Oh, yeah, 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 knee ice, knee ice. I believe that was five. But, you know, I get have a real hard time with snowboarders to know if it's a five or a seven or what because the dog go, okay, they're coming two ways. Which way do I go? I don't know. I got this. <laughs> <laughs> that was Connor. This guy just checking it. He's the coach. And that was awesome. Here come J.C. Tehan. But anyway, that was Connor Turney that just did that awesome uh, quarter pipe trick. Now, not really a quarter pipe, okay, but it's the knuckle, the cut bank of the knuckle, which, you know, can be used. <laughs> oh, Gromage! Gromage slaying it, man. That guy slayed it, you know, putting both arms up, rightfully so, in the air, you know. That's a big accomplishment. Woo! Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. See, that's what I'm saying, you know. Give a woo, smile. You don't have to be the most bitching person in the world to have fun. Again, that's what we're all about is fun here. Okay, looks like we got to take a standby. Oh, but I got him, I got him. I just, you know, he dropped in on me and I didn't start the camera in time, so that was real late. I hope I got that. Oh, insanity by the marksman. I think that was the marksman right there anyway. The marksman, he teaches these kids. And, uh, and you know, I gotta tell you, that's an awesome thing to do, you know? little give back guys okay you got the skills you're all bitching and this and that now you are gonna go help the youngsters to learn to do what you do so if that ain't good karma I don't know what is standing by let's see what they brought what did you bring what did you brought ha <laughs> little kick out but perfect clearance over the knuckle not short not deep but you know into the smooth for sure you. Oh, yeah, yeah. Liking the spread eagle with the poles between the legs, you know. They may have a name Woo. for that. <laughs> spread eagle without the poles between the legs, you know. Uh, but, yeah, that kind of scary putting that pole between your legs there. And then, oh, nice grab. Now, I do believe that was a girl on the board. Now, again, I often hate to say that because sometimes I'm wrong. The other day I saw that guy from Sweden uh coming down that's got the uh, tune in turn in drop out video and but he got such long hair and it's so nice a long hair you know and it was hanging out and i thought it was a girl and he was on the skis but it was not a girl it was a guy but one reason i was so thoroughly impressed at that moment you know was because like when you do see a girl that's like got the style of a guy and is that rad you know you get really extra excited but thing was it wasn't a girl yeah it was that guy from sweden like i told you they got the video out that they did last year they traveled all over the u.s and they're from sweden and they did a, a video a nice long video of of their trip and whatnot and again that one is called tune in turn on and drop out something like that you know what they're going to deal and be smooth so i've been here a while yeah the the let's see what he i think let's see if we can count oh no just a one that time or a three i'm sorry just a three that time so anyway three being one rotation oh knee ice knee ice oh a little sit down a little sit down but back up no harm no foul the uh sweet zone is pretty nice and steep okay okay Okay, here comes a couple of these race kids. So we've been here, this is the second lap now. So we're gonna go ahead and call it a cut here pretty quick. Sometimes it's hard for me to call these things a cut because I just enjoy myself so much and I get so excited, you know, seeing these guys all come by <laughs> on the ride, looking good on the ride. You know, it, it sometimes it's hard to stop as long as the action, you know, is happening and I don't have to stand here <laughs> too long. That was smooth, dude. You could not even hear that guy land. That was good. And again, coach doing a super job. 
Okay, so, okay, here comes Roy, aka Grant, and his friend. They're coming simultaneous. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you guys, these guys are crossovers, you know. They are race. Oh, and again. Oh my God, that's such a long shot. It's almost a shame. Anyway, those guys are freaking awesome. Okay. There. Okay, he says this one's for me. Let's see what. Screaming, screaming. I'm telling you what, man, that was, he did not grab it, okay? But you know, sometimes, you know, you don't want to grab that thing too much because then you're playing with it. So I would say that's a screaming with maybe without all the, you know, the other one there, in there. Because, <laughs> you know, he didn't have the, the, maybe the rest of it there because he was, uh, he wasn't grabbing it too hard, you know, yeah. So anyway, uh, trying to keep this stuff G, but I hope that you got a laugh, because, <laughs> oh yeah, because I'm kind of laughing, you know, uh, uh, on the on the theory of the deal. But seriously, no, I don't believe it's fully semen unless it's uh, unless it's grabbed. Okay. <laughs> Okay, enough said, man. We're getting the heck out of here. Bachelor Park, uh, standing around the jump line. Bachelor Park's jumping. I do believe it is the uh, 10th, I think. I think it's the 10th of, uh, of February. But anyway, we will get that in the title of the video. Checking out from Mount Bachelor on a flat light day. Hope you guys enjoyed the video of the Groms jumping and some not so grommy. Catch me a while ago. Here for the end of the video, and these kids been ha hanging out up here making big snow sculptures. They're making freaking igloos or something up here. I don't know what they're doing. There's Tyson, that guy did a real lap of earlier today. But they're going off, man. They're having good times because springtime conditions came around. But they're going to disappear again pretty soon. We've got snow going to be on the way. Catching me a while ago.